my name is Emily. I am the bartender here at the Toronto Hunt, and today I will be showing you how to make an Aperol Spritz. So the main two ingredients in the Aperol Spritz is Aperol, which is usually an Italian aperitif, and it's mainly made from rhubarb and other aromatic herbs, and a uh, sparkling wine, and today we will be using Prosecco. Your other options are also, for example, Cava and Cremant. And uh, now I will show you how to make an Aperol Spritz. So we start off by just using a glass. I'm using a white wine glass for today. So I'll just fill it all the way up with ice. And then we're going to try to get a layered effect. So I will add all the red ingredients. So I will add Aperol first. It's about three ounces of Aperol. In our recipe, we use cranberry juice. So I will add two ounces of cranberry juice. And then we go with our sparkling wine, also three ounces. and about two ounces of soda water just to top it up. And to garnish this drink, we use orange. Uh, I'm going to use an orange slice today, but you can also use an orange peel. Just put it straight in, just like this, add a straw. And I will also show you how to peel an orange just in case that is what you desire. You can just get a little peeler like this or a peeler like this to make smaller slices. Uh, to make it more aromatic, you can peel it right above the drink, as such, for a bigger slice. Or if you'd like a smaller slice, go with a smaller one, just dust it above. And that is it, and that is how you make an Aperol Spritz.